Good morning, everybody, and happy Sunday. It is July 21st, so I am, well, it's the end of week four of the keto, my keto cut, and it is the start of also a new week. So, um, I have to go grocery shopping, so this will be a lovely grocery haul and how I prep my meals throughout the week, or technically, typically how I grocery shop. So I have lovely, this is gonna be like old school pen and paper. So I will show you. So what I like to do first is I like to think of meals that I want for the next two weeks. Um, I used to shop on a weekly basis, but now I've decided that I just wanna start shopping every two weeks. Um, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, usually Friday, my husband likes to order in pizza, so he orders in pizza, and then him and the boys eat that Friday and Saturday, and technically Sunday, like today is like a fend for yourself day, is what I like to call it. So I like to think of meals for Monday through Thursday, and this is also leftovers for the very next day. So it can be a lunch or it can be also dinner if you don't wanna eat the dinner that I cook. So I like to do Mondays, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. Cause like I said, typically, and so that's how I write it out. I have my Mondays, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. All right, so what do I want to eat? And typically, I honestly, I cook the same meals both weeks. I mean, I'm a person of habit, so I like to eat. Don't mind my stain, it was from my face mask. <laughs> I just noticed it on camera. Um, but I'm a creature of habit, so I kind of like to eat the same thing. And so, um, like, I had it written down, like I had Meatball Monday, because I kind of like themes. So we can do Meatball Monday, just so you guys can get an idea. So on Meatball Mondays, it's typically like a spaghetti and meat sauce with also meatballs included. Um, Tuesday, you should already know what Tuesdays are, Taco Tuesday. And I like to think of meals, um, that I can make like keto friendly for myself. Um, Wednesday, um, I've heard of Wing Wednesday. There's something else, but I kind of like breakfast Wednesdays. So you can have like breakfast. My kids like to have breakfast as well. I mean, who, who doesn't? What do I have for Thursday? Oh, I had leftover Thursday, which was a great idea. Um, but I think, because my husband, my husband, <laughs> my son Liam, he's on a cheeseburger kick, so I think it'll be like cheeseburgers and hot dogs, like grill Thursday. Cheeseburgers and hot dogs. Oh, I can't spell. Okay, so now that I have it written out exactly the meals that I want, then I break it down. I break down what is in each meal that I'm going to need. So for Meatball Monday, I'm going to need ground meat, and we're, I'm back on my ground beef kick. I really like, I like me some Moo Moo. Ground beef, we need, um, I, oh, we need eggs for meatballs, we need marinara sauce, and for the boys, they need garlic bread. I pretty much have everything else. So now that I have everything I needed, like I have what I want on the day, and I have exactly what is included in that meal, then I go and I write down my meat. So, meat is first. So, I know currently in my freezer I have two packs of ground beef and then one pack of ground turkey. So that takes care of 
two, three meals. So I'm just gonna get another big thing of ground beef. Which in the one that we normally get, it's eight. So that's eight meals. And then what do I need? Meat, I just need hot dogs. Bacon, eggs. Like, I switch between putting eggs with meat and dairy. So, right now, it's going in my dairy section. I mean, my meat, my meat section and sausage. Um, once everything's done, I write it down on my handy-dandy list, like so. And then, that's it. So, for, like, meal prepping purposes, plan out what you plan on eating for the day, for the week. So, let's just say... You wanna have like chicken, rice, and broccoli for your meals throughout the week. So that's what you're gonna buy at the grocery store. You're gonna buy chicken, and you're gonna buy rice, and you're gonna buy some broccoli. And then you'll plan it out for the week. But um, I like to eat kind of what my family eats. So I try to stick to that. I try to find meals that I can make both keto friendly and what my family will always eat. So I got my list ready. The grocery store, unfortunately, in North Dakota doesn't open in town till well, on base until 11 is when the commissary opens, and then downtown it doesn't open until noon, which is just weird to me. So it is only 8.40, so I have some time to kill before then. So I'm just gonna go hang out with the chillins and Catch you guys with my grocery haul. Okay, so we just came back from the grocery store and I got my two weeks worth of groceries for under $200. I paid $163.68 for all of this. I got $6 cash back so I could tip the baggers. So as you saw, I pre, um, well I, Wrote down everything I planned on buying so that way I knew what I had planned for the week for the next two weeks. So I got two gallons of milk. I forgot to add lunch meat on the list. So I added some, I think, or maybe I did have this. I don't remember. But I got two packs of lunch meat, hot dogs, two cartons of eggs, some chicken breast, two packs of bacon, two packs of garlic bread, my Jimmy Didaline. See, I told you, Jimmy Deleen, my Jimmy Dean delights. The egg witch, my favorite, is definitely the bacon spinach and the ham and bell pepper. These two are my favorite. I'm not a broccoli fan. Like I said, I bro dieted for too long. And then the pizza I was talking about was the real good pizzas. I completely forgot the name of this, so I got two, one for this week and one for the next week. Bananas, because Cameron, is banana fiend, some shredded lettuce, and then also, like I said, it's a pack of eight. So this is one meal, that's a meal, that's a meal, that's a meal. So I got a pack of hamburger meat, two packs of hot dogs, two packs of hamburgers, a pack of regular bread, like I said, those are the buns, and then snacks for the boys, a bag of cereal, because I forgot to add that to the list. Ketchup, I got some peanut butter because Liam loves peanut butter and honey sandwiches. This is my favorite tomato sauce because the macros, oh, wrong hand. The macros are amazing and only five carbs for 125 grams. You cannot beat that. And then I got some more pickles, woo! But I got the little chips instead. And then for the boys and my husband, I got two bags of chips. Don't mind them in my sink. I ran out of space. So that is the grocery haul for the next two weeks. So I hope you guys enjoyed this grocery haul. I'm gonna get all this stuff put away, get some food in my stomach because all I've had is my coffee this morning. Get the boys some lunch and I'll catch you in next week's video. Bye.